Hey everybody, John Varekin here with you. I'm the president of RLCI. Today it's a great honor to talk to our partner churches and start off something we're going to be doing every month. Somebody from our core lead team will uh, take a little time and shoot a video, something that will encourage you, something that will uh, excite you, something that will help you uh, to grow and we'll grow together. Today, I want to take advantage of being in Asuncion, Paraguay. I've uh, been here in South America for two weeks, just in Uruguay, and now we're here in Paraguay launching a nationwide leadership project. And uh, something really, really awesome I got to experience uh, two days ago was went to the Itaipu Dam, which most Americans have never heard of it, but it's the largest energy producing dam in the world. It's about uh, seven times bigger than Hoover Dam. And uh, of course I was with John Maxwell and we did an event um, with thousands of people there. So I got to have the VIP tour of the Itaipu Dam. And it was incredible to listen to uh, what, what happens at the dam how it works, how it functions. We went down, uh, I don't remember what it was, 150 meters down underneath the river that uh, produces the energy at the dam, which is the uh, Paraná River. Comes, uh, flows through Brazil and, and, uh, and Paraguay and Argentina. But anyways, uh, with the whole tour that we took and the questions, the uh, general director of the Ho Dam, uh, Jim Spaulding, great guy, um, I, I was asking him questions how the how the dam worked and it was it was really interesting to hear what happens because I was listening to a voice and in my mind or in my spirit it reminded me of what Jesus said about the energy that we need that's produced within us to do what we need to do, to live, uh, to be pastors, to be ministers. And uh, Jesus said, my spirit will be like a river inside of you. And uh, so when I, I was talking to uh, Jim Spaulding, the, the producer of the, or the director of the dam, I said, you know, um, how, do, does the dam ever stop working? And he just laughed, he said, no. He said, there's always a demand for energy and so the dam always functions, always functions. And uh, the truth is, uh, you and I have a river on the inside that is produced by the Spirit of God and it's always there to produce the energy that this world needs through us. Energy we need to be good dads, to be uh, great husbands, the, the, the energy we need to be great ministers and pastors, it, it comes out of God's spirit that's on the inside of us. And if that and if that river, if you're not drawing that energy from that river, you're, you're trying to draw from something else and it's it just isn't gonna produce what it needs. God's given you his river of, of his spirit on the inside, and that's what helps us to be and to do who we need to be and, and what we need to do. Uh, it was funny. Uh, somebody asked a question and, and they said, you know, how much, uh, how do you know how much uh, production you have to have? He said, we, we can see ahead of time how much energy needs to be produced. We call up River to Brazil and have them send the right amount of water for us to produce the energy. <laughs> I, think, I think us as Christians and as pastors, you know, God knows what we need. He knows, he knows the draw that's going to be on our lives. And uh, so he just he just calls upstream and says, "Hey, uh, John's gonna need a little more energy output. You know with what's going on with a, with, with certain things in the church or, or whatever. Send a little more water. And that water just flows and flows and flows, and and it comes into us, through us, out to the people. That's the way you can be a long-term pastor, long-term minister." It's by God's river on the inside of you. So my encouragement to you is draw on that river. Draw on that river. Don't, 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 uh, don't allow God's river to be there. Just dam it up. Let it come through. Produce 
what it needs to produce on the inside of you because he's called us to a lost and dying world. He's called us to be, to be great leaders in our churches and, and to our people. And it's his river that produces that. So my encouragement to you as your friend today is let that river flow every single day. And that river will produce the energy you need to supply to everybody else that's drawing off of you. Have a great month this month. Next month, somebody else will be back with you, one of our uh, core lead team uh, leaders, and excited to do ministry together with you. God bless you.